Hello Tech Excellence fans, it's Shah Faisal Afridi here. The air is buzzing with excitement and the tech world is on the edge of its seat. The rumor mill is churning and the iPhone 16 Pro Max is on everyone's lips. From tech blogs to social media, everyone is speculating about what Apple has in store for us this time. Is this just another yearly refresh, or is Apple about to drop a game changer? With each new model, expectations rise and this year is no different. We're diving deep into the leaks and whispers to give you the full scoop. From credible sources to wild speculations, we've got it all covered. Buckle up because we're about to break down everything we know so far. Whether you're a casual user or a hardcore techie, there's something here for everyone. From potential release dates to rumored specs, we're dissecting it all. Mark your calendars because the launch date might be closer than you think. We'll explore the design upgrades, camera enhancements, and all the little tweaks that make a big difference. Is the new design sleeker, more ergonomic? Let's find out. And of course, the powerhouse A18 chip. What kind of performance boost can we expect? Will it revolutionize mobile computing? Stay tuned. By the end of this ride, you'll be able to decide if the iPhone 16 Pro Max is worthy of your hard-earned cash, or if you're better off sticking with your trusty old device. We'll weigh the pros and cons to help you make an informed decision, or maybe, just maybe, you'll find that your current phone still meets all your needs. After all, not every upgrade is a must-have. So, whether you're an Apple diehard or an Android enthusiast considering a Switch, this one's for you. Let's get into it. We'll compare it to the latest Android offerings to see how it stacks up. Are you ready for a bigger screen, a faster processor, and a camera that will blow your mind? Let's find out. We'll delve into the display technology, the processing power, and the camera capabilities to see if it lives up to the hype. Okay, let's talk timelines and dollars. When can you expect to get your hands on this shiny new iPhone and how much will it set you back? Historically, Apple likes to stick to a predictable schedule and all signs point to a mid-September release for the iPhone 16 Pro Max. That means you can probably mark your calendars for sometime around the second or third week of September. Of course, Apple loves a good surprise, so don't be shocked if they throw a curveball. Now, for the million-dollar question, the price. Rumors suggest a starting price of $1,199 for the base model. Yes, that's a hefty chunk of change, but keep in mind, you're getting what's touted as the most advanced iPhone yet. But hey, maybe Apple will surprise us with a more wallet-friendly price tag we can dream, right? Let's be real, design is a big deal, and Apple knows it. The company has always prided itself on creating devices that are not only functional, but also visually stunning. The sleek lines, the premium materials, and the attention to detail all contribute to an aesthetic that is unmistakably Apple. The iPhone 16 Pro Max isn't expected to stray too far from its predecessor's aesthetics but with some notable tweaks. These subtle changes are what keep Apple fans coming back for more, year after year. It's the perfect blend of familiarity and innovation. The most significant change? A rumored 6.86-inch display. This would make it one of the largest screens ever on an iPhone, providing users with even more space to enjoy their favorite content. That's right, even bigger than the already massive 6.7-inch screen on the iPhone 15 Pro Max. This increase in size might seem minor, but for those who use their phones for everything from watching videos to working on the go, every fraction of an inch counts. Get ready for an even more immersive viewing experience. But wait, there's more. The larger display isn't just about size, it's about enhancing the overall user experience. Imagine the clarity, the vibrancy, and the sheer joy of interacting with such a large, high-quality screen. Word on the street is that Apple is slimming down those bezels even further, giving you more screen real estate than ever before. This means less distraction and more content, making everything from reading articles to playing games more enjoyable. Imagine watching your favorite movies and playing graphics-intensive games on a display that seems to stretch from edge to edge. Talk about eye candy. The edge-to-edge -edge design not only looks stunning, but also makes the device feel more immersive and engaging. And let's not forget about those whispers of an under-display front-facing camera. This innovation could revolutionize the way we take selfies and make video calls, offering a seamless and unobstructed view. Could this be the year Apple finally ditches the notch? The notch has been a defining feature of the iPhone for years, but an under-display camera would mark a significant shift in design philosophy. We'll have to wait and see. 
The anticipation is part of the excitement, and Apple has a knack for keeping us on the edge of our seats. Whether it's the larger display, the slimmer bezels, or the potential for an under-display camera, the iPhone 16 Pro Max promises to be a device worth waiting for. Section 4. Camera Prowess Ultra-Wide Gets Ultra-Upgraded Alright, photography fanatics, this one's for you. The iPhone's camera has always been a major selling point, and the 16 Pro Max is rumored to take things to a whole new level. While the main and telephoto lenses are expected to get some solid upgrades, the real star of the show is the ultra-wide camera. Rumors suggest Apple is bumping it up to a whopping 48 megapixels. That's a significant jump from the current 12 megapixels, and it means you can capture even more detail and clarity in your shots, especially in low-light conditions. Think sharper landscapes, more vibrant cityscapes, and group photos where everyone looks their best. But megapixels aren't everything. Apple is also rumored to be enhancing its image processing software, so you can expect even better image quality overall. Get ready to up your photography game. Section 5. Performance Powerhouse a 18 chip and battery life, let's face it, a phone is only as good as its processor, and the iPhone 16 Pro Max is rumored to pack some serious power under the hood. Enter the A18 chip, Apple's next-generation processor built on a cutting-edge 3 nanometer process. What does that mean for you? Lightning-fast performance, smoother multitasking, and improved energy efficiency. Basically, everything you do on your phone will be faster and smoother than ever before. Gamers, rejoice! The A18 chip is said to feature an upgraded GPU, delivering console-quality graphics and making those intense gaming sessions even more immersive. And of course, we can't forget about battery life. Rumors suggest the iPhone 16 Pro Max will boast a larger battery capacity, coupled with the A18 chip's energy efficiency. You can expect all-day battery life, even with heavy usage. No more battery anxiety here. Section 6, iOS 18, AI takes center stage. Software is just as important as hardware and iOS 18 is rumored to be a game changer. Apple is going all in on artificial intelligence and iOS 18 is expected to be deeply integrated with AI features. Think smarter Siri, more personalized recommendations, and enhanced privacy features. Imagine a Siri that can understand your needs better than ever before, providing proactive assistance and anticipating your requests. Or picture an iPhone that learns your photography habits and automatically adjusts camera settings to capture the perfect shot every time. That's the power of AI and iOS 18 is rumored to bring it to your fingertips. From improved facial recognition to advanced health tracking, iOS 18 is shaping up to be the most intelligent and intuitive iPhone operating system yet. Section 7. The upgrade dilemma. Is iPhone 16 Pro Max worth it? This is the question on everyone's mind as Apple continues to push the boundaries of smartphone technology. So here's the million dollar question. Should you invest in the latest iPhone or stick with what you have? Is the iPhone 16 Pro Max worth the hype and more importantly, is it worth your hard earned cash? Let's dive deeper into what this new model offers. The price tag is hefty, no doubt about it. But what do you get for that investment? Well, the answer as always is it depends. It depends on what you're looking for in a smartphone and how much you're willing to spend. If you're rocking an iPhone 13 Pro or older, the 16 Pro Max will undoubtedly feel like a significant upgrade. The leap in technology from the iPhone 13 Pro to the iPhone 16 Pro Max is substantial. The 16 Pro Max offers a larger display, which is perfect for those who love to watch videos or play games on their phone. The screen is not just bigger, but also brighter and more vibrant. You'll get a larger display, a more powerful processor, and a vastly improved camera system. The new A18 chip ensures that everything runs smoothly, whether you're multitasking or playing graphics-intensive games. And let's not forget the camera. The iPhone 16 Pro Max boasts a camera system that rivals professional cameras. With improved, low-light performance and advanced computational photography, your photos and videos will look better than ever. Not to mention all the new software features of iOS 18, from enhanced privacy settings to new productivity tools, iOS 18 makes the iPhone 16 Pro Max even more powerful. But what if you're already using an iPhone 14 Pro or 15 Pro Max? The upgrades might not be as drastic. The iPhone 14 Pro and 15 Pro Max are already excellent devices, and the improvements in the 16 Pro Max, while significant, may not be enough to justify an upgrade for everyone. The upgrades might not be as drastic. The camera improvements will certainly be noticeable, 
especially if you're into photography or videography, the camera improvements will certainly be noticeable, and the A18 chip will bring a performance boost. The new chip means faster processing, better graphics, and improved battery life, and the A18 chip will bring a performance boost. This means faster app launches, smoother multitasking, and better overall performance. Ultimately, the decision comes down to your individual needs and budget. If you're someone who always wants the latest and greatest technology, and money is no object, then the iPhone 16 Pro Max is a no-brainer. If you're craving the absolute latest and greatest technology and money is no object, then go for it. You'll be getting one of the best smartphones on the market, but if you're content with your current iPhone, you might be better off waiting another year or two. The iPhone 14 Pro and 15 Pro Max are still excellent devices, and they will continue to serve you well. You might be better off waiting another year or two. Either way, the iPhone 16 Pro Max is shaping up to be an impressive device. Apple has once again pushed the boundaries of what a smartphone can do. The iPhone 16 Pro Max is shaping up to be an impressive device, and it'll be exciting to see what Apple officially unveils later this year. With each new release, Apple sets a new standard for the industry, and it'll be exciting to see what Apple officially unveils later this year. Whether you decide to upgrade or not, the iPhone 16 Pro Max is sure to make waves in the tech world.